Atlas Copco's GHS vacuum pump with variable speed drive technology is a game changer. Here's why. Consider a process, any process really. In this generic example, raw material is processed to create a finished product. Now let's add nothing. By that, we mean vacuum. Vacuum is often applied to a process to increase product quality. In our example, the vacuum is used to remove unwanted gases. That is what the balloons stand for. A pump supplies the vacuum. That pump is represented here by Vacman. Because it eats the gases, you get the idea. But what vacuum pump should you choose? In the past, the routine choice was a fixed speed pump. You would consider the peak demand of your process and install a pump with a capacity matched to that demand. As long as the process is running at peak demand, the fixed speed pump is in its element. Vacman is steadily munching away. Everything is in balance. But often, the demand coming from the process is variable. And when the demand reduces, the balance is disturbed. The fixed speed pump can't adjust. Vacman keeps chomping at the same rate. The gas has to expand to achieve balance. Notice how the balloons grow. Why is this a problem? Because a vacuum pump that works at a lower pressure than what is needed is wasting energy. When demand to a fixed speed machine reduces, the pressure drops too. This is comparable to idling load for compressors. But the energy consumption of a fixed speed pump when idling is still 60 to 80% of its peak power. So the fixed speed pump is not only gobbling gases, but eating up energy as well. Now, there's a better solution. In the real world, the flow rate coming from a process is almost always variable. Why would you use a fixed speed machine when conditions are variable? Atlas Copco's variable speed drive technology saves the day. This new Vacman adjusts the speed at which he eats to match the demand coming from the process. Reducing demand to a variable speed pump makes the machine slow down. The pressure is held constant. That results in significant energy savings. For instance, if the demand goes down 50%, then the power consumption of the variable speed pump is also halved. Variable speed pumps have other advantages too. Many factories have a centralized vacuum system with multiple vacuum pumps. When demand increases, an additional machine starts. Fixed speed pumps are ill-equipped to deal with such temporary spikes in demand. Because when demand drops again, all pumps continue to run. Typically, a minimum run period of 10 minutes is needed to prevent mechanical damage. A variable speed vacuum pump is much better suited to deal with such fluctuating demand. It may well be game over for fixed speed pumps because variable speed technology results in energy savings of around 50%. Let Atlas Copco's VSD technology take your productivity to the next level.